Amo has seen PMO Dr. Jitendra Singh Ture said that it seems that a deep conspiracy was hashed behind Bharatiya Janata Party State Secretary Anil Parihar's killing, and it is an attempt to revive militancy and violence in Kishtwar. BJP MLA Lal Singh today asked the government to bring culprits to book involved in killing of State Secretary Anil Parihar and his brother at Kishtwar. Lal Singh said different theories are emerging over this incident and asked the government to punish the culprits. State unit of Congress today held a protest against killing of BJP leader and his brother in Kishtwar. Party blamed Pakistan of disturbing peace in the area and also accused BJP of failing on all fronts. The parents of a Kashmiri student who had joined IS has appealed to the terrorist Zakir Musa and other terrorist outfit to release him. Over 140 people, mostly truckers, were rescued from Pir Ki Gali along the Mughal Road, which recorded the season's first heavy snowfall over the past couple of days. The rescue operation continued till 3 a.m. Saturday and some sick passengers were shifted to the hospital for treatment. Rajori residents today protested against the killing of BJP State Secretary and his brother in Kishtwar and accused Pakistan of spreading terror in the state. The protesters alleged that Pakistan wants to disturb the coming panchayat polls in the state through such acts. Deputy Commissioner Jammu Ture launched Pradhan Mantri Jan Arogya Yojana Health Scheme Awareness Drive in Jammu. Under this scheme, poor, deprived and deserving people will be given monetary help to get the best possible treatment. Kashmir Valley on Saturday received season's first snowfall, which began in the higher reaches of the valley on Thursday, disconnecting Kargil and all weather stations across the valley witnessed a drop of around 10 degrees Celsius. This is all today we have in this bulletin. For latest news and updates, do subscribe Excelsior News.